time. Here we go. I accidentally put this thing for AM this morning, and to those of you showed up, thank you so much. To those of you who sent messages, thank you so much. My bad, I forgot to hit the PM instead of the AM, so welcome, welcome. It's Friday. We're at the newest Goodwill in Las Vegas. We came here two Fridays ago. We're gonna check out and see exactly how the shelves are. They were packed last week. They were packed. It was incredible. There was so much stuff. So I want to see how much is in there. And I got a little uh, trick for you. They got a color tag of the week. It's gray right now. And the stuff here has only been out for like two weeks. So normally the color tags, at least in Las Vegas, are stuff that's been there for like four weeks long and they want to see it gone. So that's why they mark it half off and then down to a dollar. But this stuff's only been here two weeks. It's all new, fresh merchandise because the store just opened. So yeah, we're gonna go inside there, check it out. Thank you for stopping in. Don't forget to smack the thumbs up button if you're on the replay, I appreciate it. Josie's Jazzy Junk, Heidi, how you, how you doing? Guy Nice, hey yo. So yeah, we're gonna go inside. It's been a great week. I put out two videos on YouTube, one of the grand opening of this store. I had a blast. Biscuit Butt, thank you so much for joining us. Hope you're having a good day, Archie. And uh, Granny Franny's in the house. So yeah, I put out the video, the grand opening. I went to the VIP party the night before. I waited in line right here, right here. That's where the donuts were. The donuts were, I had three donuts and I had some donut on my face right here. It did look like a mole, it did look like a mole, but I talked to a hundred people inside, not one of them told me I had chocolate on my face. Typical Mikey. So I put out that video and I put out the third installment of my yard sale videos. Not the final installment, because I'm gonna tell you guys how much I made. And I did a whatnot earlier today, four o'clock on Fridays, I'm doing whatnot now. I sold some stuff from the storage unit, 22 items, all from the storage unit for a little over $100 take home. So I'm excited about that more uh more storage money so i'm going to do a follow-up vid tell you how much i've made so far a lot of it i've sold a lot of it's still on ebay and a lot of it i still do have to sell especially all that jewelry i'm going to sell that next week at friday friday at four so let's go on inside here take a look on the outside it's 60 degrees out here friends i'm in here we go goodwill i'm in just my timu shirt shout out timu all right Tafari, how you doing? Thank you so much for joining us. When you reported your temperature, it was so, so cold. I want to go to New York, but I'm not going in the winter. I'm a West Coast boy. I'm out here in my, my Timu Hawaiian today. So check all this out, all the stuff that they put up, like uh, the stickers and all that stuff all throughout Goodwill. The same husband and wife team have done it for like the last, I don't know, 10 Goodwills or something. But actually the wife did most of the work here this, at this one. So yeah, all the decals, all the stickers, they keep it in the family. All right, have you gone to the dump yet from the storage unit? Yes. Acid, thank you so much for joining us. I did go to the, I, we went to the dump. I had to clear all that stuff out in 72 days. All right, Biscuit Butt said, Mikey, your storage unit video with your sister was incredible, bro. If anybody hasn't seen it yet, they should go watch it. Thank you. Thank you, Arch. We had so much fun. We're going to do it again. My sister had a blast. My brother-in-law had a blast. If you're in my what dot tonight, you got a secret inside, insider information that we can't share on YouTube. So let's check us out here in Goodwill. They got a little Raider section. They got some shoes. The shelves do look to be stacked. Thank you, Heidi. Welcome, welcome. Yeah, the storage unit was fun. I had fun creating it. And it's just my first storage unit video. So they're only, they're only gonna get better. They're only gonna get better. No moonshine was drinking during the filming of the show. We were so excited about the moonshine and I don't drink anymore because of my medications. My sister doesn't drink. My brother-in-law will have some brewskis. I mean, we all used to have brewskis when we were younger, but we were so excited about the moonshine, friends. We don't even drink. We don't even drink moonshine. We were so excited. All right. The gun. We found two guns. We found two guns. Gloria, hello from India. Spoiled video. We did find two guns. That one was like a little, just a little, I think it was a real pellet gun. It was tiny. It was little. And then a uh, marksman bb gun and they have an incredible sell through rate but mine didn't work i couldn't get it to work i'm no bb gun expert so i sold it for parts i think i took 12 dollars plus 10 shipping so all right sandra thank you so much for joining us friday nights how we do it so yeah i i did sell that i sold so many items from the storage unit it's been incredible it was great it was great to list it yep 
It was a BB gun. So they got some stuff out fresh on the racks. I'm gonna check out some hard goods to start out the night. Got the music blaring in here, but it's all good. It's all good. If it gets demonetized, friends, I don't mind. I come out here to find some good thrifting finds. Everybody shows up to hang out on Friday night, so how could we not? Do you think it was worth the labor in the unit? Um, I was trying to calculate all the hours of labor I put in, and truthfully, if I had to pay my brother-in-law and sister-in-law for all the hours they put in, they put in, I think it was like, probably my brother-in-law, Man, my brother-in-law really came through. But my sister, I think maybe we did it for like five hours the first day. And yeah, my brother-in-law came back probably for another three hours. So if I had to pay them, it would be uh, it would be a lot more. But I had free help. So free help really helps. That's what I've discovered during this. Free help really helps. And I've tried, I'll try to calculate more of all the hours. Cause I mean, I had to list a lot of the stuff. We had to clean a lot of the stuff and it's been pretty labor intensive but luckily i found some good items in there so i'm getting a good return for all my hours and all my work if if i didn't find anything and still had to do all that work and then didn't find any good items i might be a little bummed but i think it's it's doing decently for how much work i've put in versus how much i've got out of it for sure I made another hundred bucks tonight i want not just selling the stuff so Oh, the GAT, yes, we talk about GATs. It's all about the GAT here. All right, Mark's been here for 12 hours. Joseph said, I got a great unit. Beats being Uber, yeah, for sure. When you can find something and then just take it somewhere and get a couple hundred bucks, it's pretty exciting, it's pretty exciting. So yeah, I paid like 209, I think it was, or 220 total, and I, I I've made well over that. Show the shelves. Donna, 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 I know. I gotta show the shelves, but Mikey, here we go. There you go, Donna, that's for you. All right, mirror, it's the Mikey bag show. I love to turn it on myself, what can I say? I like to see myself in the phone. All right, oh, what is this? But as always, I don't have my phone, this is cheap. World Market, World Market's cool. World Market is a great, great shop. All right, I'm a resell it. How you doing? Thank you for hanging out with us tonight. We're just uh, in Goodwill's newest store. Now here, we were here two weeks ago and these shelves were literally packed. There was no room. I picked up some Lucite grapes. We already got some bids on them on whatnot. So the Lucite grapes are going in two weeks. Friends, two weeks on whatnot. I usually sell those on eBay, but I'm bringing them to whatnot. I hope someone gets a deal. All right, oh. These, uh, I don't buy these things. I'll buy the Fenton ones. They don't go for a lot, but the Fenton ones, I sell them on whatnot. I sell for like 12 to 20. I don't know what these are. I don't too mess, mess with too much many shoes, especially ceramic shoes. I wonder how much they've been restocking. Oh, look at this. Uh, is this an ornament? Metropolitan Museum of New York. I don't know what the slipper represents for the Met. Tripolian, but maybe you know. What's that? Reed and Barton. Reed and Barton, 102. Kind of cool inside. Got the thinker. Everyone's thinking here. Let's see. They've really done some damage on the shelves. I was hoping there'd be more here. We'll see. We'll see. Oh, these coconuts are always so fun. I wanted one of these so bad when I was a kid. I might even had one. $8 here. But the coconut coin jar from Hawaii, this is like top-notch stuff when you're a kid. Man, I just wanted so little back then. Just a little co carved coconut, monkey. All right, how are you all doing tonight? Let me know where you're from. Let me know how cold it is. It was only 60 degrees. It was 60 degrees when I came out. I'm in my Hawaiian shirt. This is a seashell and it's really a shame. It's really a shame it's got that crack there. It's like hand painted. Oh, let's turn it around. $1.99. Natural on that side. Painted on this side. She's a beaut. She's a beaut, I gotta say. But lobotomized. So we gotta, we gotta let it go. Gotta let it go. What else do we have here? Some interesting stuff. 
Some elephant bookends. A little rose flower vase. Is that Rose? I'm not sure. Stephanie, hello, hello, welcome. Just out thrifting at Goodwill. The newest, newest store in Las Vegas. I was here two weeks ago. This is a little Bahama, like acrylic in there. I don't know. I never buy anything that says Bahamas on it, I gotta say, except Tommy Bahama. I will buy Tommy Bahama. Let's see what else we have down here. Some drawer knobs. They're kind of cute. 65 in SoCal, but we're getting rain for the next few days. Cali B, that means usually we get rain, so I'll expect that. Nebraska, three degrees in Nebraska. Not Nebraska, Nebraska. Youch, youch. Got Wisconsin coming in at 14 degrees. Wow, friends. 60 degrees, I'm pretty cold. I'm pretty, pretty cold. 36 degrees in North, Northwest Louisiana. 21 degrees in the morning, oh boy. 26 degrees in New York. 42 and dropping. Oh, I am glad y'all are hanging out in Las Vegas tonight. It's only 60 degrees here. So take off your sweater, hang out, and enjoy the weather. I can't wait till it's sunshine at six o'clock. We'll probably start going back outside. This is a, is that a Fukugawa? Something, Fukugawa? Arita and painted in Japan right there. We got rain in the forecast for tomorrow, Mark's reporting. Thank you, Mark. Yeah, usually SoCal, it just blows this way. Yeah. All that stuff is blowing in from SoCal, including the people. Hey, yo. Pina Colada, Italy, 0.5. And it's got like a, I don't know, it looks like a Spencer skirt on it. plastic i think it's plastic sarah's saying those uh the mesh shoe ornaments can sell up for 25 and up it looks like sarah this is why i bring you guys all along live all right we gotta check the sell-through rates i'm sure i hope you know about checking sell-through rates when you check up comps you gotta see what people are asking but you gotta make sure that people are buying so yeah the met thing Four dollars, four dollars. I'm gonna put it in there. All right. We'll check it out. Oh, some Pyrex. Not Pyrex. Not Pyrex. Can't read it. I can't read it. Carrying one. Greetings from Ontario, Canada, where it's 18, 18. All right, Sarah. Thank you so much. I'm gonna bag that then. 425, and that thing is so little to. Uh, to store should be easy to ship so that's pretty bagalicious if you ask me just like a hand for like jewelry it's kind of carved out right there interesting slinging some jewelry friends i don't even know what i got super quartz uh, i think gonna gonna help out on my next whatnot because it's jewelry and i can't describe jewelry i describe jewelry it's a necklace bracelet Gloria's report, nine degrees and snow flurries in Indiana. Woo-wee, snow flurries. I did not miss snow flurries. All right, crystal bells. I always think bells are so impressive. No one uses that technology. Jody's reporting crazy snow. Oh, friends, the outfit of the day. I got my Timu top on, my Timu top. I got some uh, nice little sweatpants going, nothing special, my on clouds, and look at this hat. Right here, drink more coffee. Right there, Dutch Brothers. Just got it brand new at Goodwill. $4 for a brand new hat. That's the kind of value shopping I like to do to keep myself fitted, friends. I can't afford a $25 hat. $4, brand new. Drink more coffee, Dutch Brothers. Count me in. All right, I sold some salt and pepper shakers today. They were Cracker Barrel pigs from the pig unit. If you guys saw, I sold a bunch of stuff that was pig related today. I sold the pig pillow. I sold some pig pill, piggy banks. I sold a uh, Tracy Lynn's report, 90 degrees in Tennessee with some snow. We sold a pork porcelain trinket box. We sold two piggy banks. Yeah, that pig pillow, lots of pig related items. My sister wanted to get a pig counter when we were doing the unit, and I'm just not that technologically savvy to have the, the pig counter up yet. It was a great, great idea. 
lot of work on the graphics. All right. So I hope you're wondering. No worries, Cali B. I'm going live on whatnot every Friday at four o'clock now, Pacific time. That's my plan. Then we're going to come here at six and then we're going to hang out. So I'm keeping an uh, active, active schedule on social media and, and selling on Fridays. Storage Invader 702, hello, hello, hello. Welcome. Bought my first storage unit. ATL Flippers, how you guys doing? Thank you for joining tonight. We're headed in uh, Goodwill, my favorite place to be. Here two weeks ago, the shelves were packed. They were packed. So I'm looking to get my, my second unit soon. My brother-in-law and sister are lined up already. So I'm pretty excited about that. I don't know if I'm gonna go the same size. I don't think I could go bigger. That was so much work. I don't have extra storage around to hold all this stuff. So I, I'm, I might have to get a storage unit myself, but I don't wanna have to start paying for a storage unit. If that's what I gotta do to grow though, I might have to. All right, Paula Walker saw the post for AM and figured it out, shit happens. Shit with a C. Yeah, that was my bad. I didn't know. I got some messages. I appreciate the messages. Appreciate everyone for understanding. Oh, they're all like falling off. That's kind of cool. Some more Christmas stuff. Let's see. I'm not a Christmassy guy. Did I see all the storage unit with all the Jordans. I have not, have not. And I probably know I'm not even a Jordan guy to be bidding on that. People see Jordans, they like to put out the dough. But I'll take a look, Ski. For sure. All right, let's see. What else we got here? In the wooden, in the wooden stuff now. Yeah, I hope y'all are enjoying just the visual ride. Nice little relaxing Friday night at Goodwill. Strolling along. Oh, we got another carved monkey coconut. So cute, so cute. Every time, every time. Oh, look at this little figurine. Look at the little toesies. Some great detail with those toes. I gotta say, I gotta say. All right, the Easy Jig Bracelet Maker. I made some bracelets like in summer camp. It's very summer camp activity. Getting cozy. Christy said hello. Joy watching you uh, unpack the storage units. Well, thank you for watching it and coming out. Storage Invader 702, do I sell at Broad Acres? Uh, no, I don't sell at Broad Acres. My boy Sunny Las Vegas and Carrie the Desert Mermaid sell at Broad Acres. I might go out there one day. Um, like I, if I get the, keep getting these storage units, I, I might have to, because a lot of the stuff I just ditched out on because I didn't want to sell it and I don't have a place to store it either. So I just let it go. But if I did the flea market, for sure these storage units, so much more stuff I could be I could be selling and making money on. But also the flea market's a lot of work. You gotta haul all that stuff in and out of there and stand around all day. So that's that kind of slows me down too. But I'm not opposed to it. Especially if I get some unit that's just all uh, flea market, I'll be like, I'm going to the flea market. Tell Supercourt, we're headed to the flea market. All right, Holy Toledo. That's a cool sign, old school. What is this thing? Oh, shoehorn. It's kind of gross, actually. All right, got a bunch of sign. Three reasons for teaching, June, July, and August. Yes, so you can find a second job for the other months, so you can get pizzade. All right. There's my hot take. My hot take on teacher's pay right there. We're getting frisky tonight, friends. We're getting frisky. All right. Ooh, the elf cookie cutter. Buddy. $5 a big lots. That's highway robbery. Highway robbery. They're jacking worse than Goodwill. How much is Goodwill charging? Let's see. Let's see. Let's see. Oh, $1.99. All right. They did it right. We should have played the guessing game, but I, I thought they were going to have that one right. How could you how could you charge more than two dollars for Buddy the Elf maker? Right. See what else we can find. We're also looking for a full length mirror. Super Court's on the lookout for a full length mirror. This is a section. This is a nice iron cross right there. 
It's got some boo-boos. You can fix that right there. Where's that bad boy? Five dollars only. Five dollars. Ain't too bad. Ain't too bad. Yes, the goal of the Knights to get to 100 thumbs up. It's not much. Hit that thumbs up if you're able. If you're watching on your TV and not logged in, I understand that too. Just give me a virtual thumbs up. I can feel it. I can feel it. So, oh, look at that. Cox. That's our local cable company. I don't know what kind of Cox sponsored thing that is. Popcorn tin? I'm not sure. I am not sure. Got some pewter plates here. Oh no, Wilton Armtail. Fifteen dollars. I like them. I like the design, but I, I don't buy anything pewter. When I first started, I was like, pewter, it's old, it's cool, but it's not valuable. I mean, some of it can be. But it's not for me. Alright, let's see what else what we might have on this side here. Fake flowers, lots of fake flowers, but maybe we'll see a vase. Ooh, that's that gelatin stuff in there. That stuff always freaks me out. That old gelatin jelly stuff. Do they still make that stuff these days? It's always like so old, nasty, and a little creepy. I don't know. I don't know. That's just me. Gelatin old molds. Oh, this is kind of nice right here. It's plastic. It's like a little hanging... Uh, I'm going to embarrass myself. Geranium can't even say it friends i am so tired today had a long day whatnot i was hanging out with sunny las vegas earlier today we brunched it up hung out with uh two glassy sisters susan we had a good time we went thrifting and i i am just uh i'm pooped i'm pooped can you hear it in my voice i can uh, is this thing a fakie right here That's Crazy looking hobnail. Yeah, $2.99. Just see it. Even I could see that. Even I could see that. Terrarium. That's it. I could see it. I couldn't, I couldn't say it or see it earlier. Yeah, out here embarrassing myself. But that's not the first time. I do not pronunciate stuff well, friends. You hear me? All right. I don't really try it either. That's what Supercourt doesn't like. It's just like, you don't even try. I'm like, because I don't doesn't matter to me it don't matter all right i don't use the queen's english i use mikey's english there's not a dictionary yet but i'm sure some of you have picked up on it kathy yes hello hello hi mikey hey tv watchers uh hit the thumbs up button on your remote oh hit the thumbs up on your boat remote all right scott lungwitz can you refresh please all right you'll be having some blur there's the clear glass oh some other little little things right here. Ooh, I found a, a cool woven art thing today. It's gonna be in a, a video coming up pretty soon. I think those are like 60, 80 bucks. It's pretty cool. It's pretty cool. Alright, let's keep it moving. Let's keep it moving. Big store here. Look at the size. Not a whole lot of people in here. Oh, they got some new carts out. Let's go look at the new carts. Here we go, here we go. Guitar Missy, hello, hello, welcome. Thank you for joining us today. I'm Goodwill's newest store. Checking to see what they got. I bet you this thing's gonna be worth it, right? This is a, uh, like, sometimes these are valuable because they're teaching tools. Um, touching them, he feels very, very cheap. I mean, look, he's got, he's got all the parts, all the parts that come out. Let's check out, oh, check out the rear. All right, $5 only. It's not marked. Like I said, it feels like a cheap one, but I almost think this thing might be worth it for five bucks. If I just had my phone to take a picture and Google scan, I think it's gonna be worth it. We used to have the super court said I had a puncture dude. So uh, yeah, medical thing right here learning lesson maybe i'll take them out maybe i'll try i don't think you can do cpr all right yeah we got we got a anatomy model there it is all right missy you can always email me anything friends email me mikey bags of money at yahoo 
you can just say hi. You can ask reselling questions. Some people email me, ask me about reselling, ask me. Hi. I try to respond best I can. A lot of it goes to the junk mail, I gotta say. Gotta get better about checking the old junk. Um, I don't know what that is. It's like, I don't, it doesn't feel like a book and it shows rings on there. I don't know. <laughs> Mark, Mark, thank you for trying. Thank you for trying. Oh, is this a diary? Yeah, oh, a journal. Well, I don't know. A year of devotion for couples. I don't know what I'm looking at, but I was trying to get down to this. I thought it was going to be cool. Oh, I got jizzed. Oh, no. Friends. I don't know what that was. Oh, and this is going to look cheap right here. It felt cheap. I thought it was going to be nice. I don't think it is. Uh, Super Court digs that kind of stuff right there. A little tray with a mirror. Some iron on it. Just not, not a quality. Well, I also sold the sheet set for just $5 today on my whatnot, friends. A pair of brand new sheets, queen size, went for $5 on whatnot. Make sure you check it out over there. Okay. Oh, this one's got even some smaller knickknacks. All right. Let's see. You guys want to dig in there with me? Got some cards. Calendar. Whoa. Angel plate. Heaven's helper. Do not buy plates, friends. Slow no sellers. Oh, cool carved wood figurine. Peek over there. <coughs> oh, excuse me. What are these things? Card art. Cute couple. Got here. <coughs> oh, I'm sorry about the coffee friends. Hold on a second. Thank you all for coming along, hanging out on Friday night. We're going to go look for some more stuff. I just got to say hi. So let's keep it going. Thanks. Yeah, cool. see what we got. Oh, thank you. I like it. Yeah, okay. me too. He's, I'm going to learn some stuff tonight. <laughs> all right, friends. One compliment already. It's cool. It's cool. Oh, look at this. You can get a fleet a fleet of iRobots. Look at that. You can send them all through the house. Turn them on all at one time and just get the house done in like five minutes. I don't know. I don't have an iRobot. I don't know how fast they go. I'm pretty sure $7.99, if it works, probably worth buying. Oh, because that one's $7.99 and that one is $25. And the two. How are you doing, Sarah? Thank you for hanging out Friday night with us. Hope you're having good. Oh, that one's $69. What is the price difference in these things? They used to be a Goodwill. They'd all be like $7, all of them. Hmm. I don't know. Does anyone in here have a robot made like the Jetsons? Mikey vacuumed today. I'm a house husband, friends. And I got out the vacuum today. No shame in my game. I did a good job. Did a pretty good job. All right. Eureka vacuum. Not too much into the used vacuums. I, I've bought a couple, like even this Dyson ball right here. How much this Dyson ball probably sells for like 150 on eBay, right? You just gotta ship it, that's the problem. Like just put it like in a golf bag box, a huge one, a huge one. All right, Sarah's got one. Yeah, I, I, I dig it, I like the idea. That's That's actually a pretty good bargain right there. That's why you come on down to the Goodwill. All right. I mean, it is used, but where else are you going to get a used Dyson for $25? 25 measly dollars. All right. Oh, let's look at this art puzzle right here. Oh, yes. Oh, it's the candy of past. I've never had a Sky Bar, Reese's, yes. Turkish, no. Fifth Avenue, yes. Raisin. New York peppermint patty, powerhouse, no cracker. Instead of honey, yes, boys, Henry, yes, 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 he. 
Good and Plenty. That's the. That's not even the box that I know of Good and Plenty. I used to love Good and Plenty. Sugar, so good. Mr. Guard Bar. Juju Bees. Oh, I love. I love Juju Bees. That was before they had a lot of others. Pop Rocks. Super Core ate some of those on the stream for the first time. All those eco wafers. All right, all right. I'm getting myself hungry. Getting hungry. Let's let's check out some of the big items. We're gonna head head on over to some clothes. Some big old cabinets, twenty dollars. This dark brown one's actually kind of nice. Actually kind of nice. Oh, boom! Hotel cabinet, friends. With a safe into one of these at a Goodwill, but we couldn't we couldn't crack the code. For an Airbnb, boom, bang, bang. This is a nice one. Nineteen dollars. You run an Airbnb or just need some uh, cabinet space. All right. Moving along. Oh, the other furniture. Oh, these are actually kind of nice right here. It's yellow level shelves, and they're like really dirty. I can't even pick it up with one. Man, I want to like put that in my garage. I want to put it in my garage. Only four dollars too. Only four dollars. Hot diggity dang. All right. What else do we got here? We've got a rocker footrest chair. East Ohio, Northeast Ohio, 19 degrees, feels like eight. Oh my, feels too cold for me. Six dollars there. They're not gouging for everything here, friends. They're not gouging. Get Zick, it's here for a live. Patty, how you doing? Thank you for hanging out. We're at Goodwill's newest store. All right, now probably if you're a reseller, this is, this is something you'd want to invest in. But Mikey, I don't buy this type of stuff. This is too big for me. A Canon printer, large black and white for 200 bucks. Look at this thing. This thing's probably like a $5,000 printer. I don't know. It's the Image Photograph TA20. This thing prints out monstrosity things. I mean, look at that paper roll right there. Wow. I don't know what it does, but I'm sure it's worth more than 200 bucks. Some huge Canon like that. Oh. Got some kind of JBL old box looking thing right here. What we got here? Oh, it's heavy. This one's $125. A couple years ago, Goodwill wouldn't even have the Augacity. I said Augacity because that's not how I say it, friends. I have a friend that does. But right there, the Audacity for $126. You're even bilking an extra dollar. It couldn't even be $124. Goodwill. The homies of Goodwill. You know what they got? Oh, look at this lamp. Oh boy, what's gonna be the price on this beauty? I don't know, I don't, lamps, it's not my specialty, but this is special. This one's special, look at this. It's only $20. I don't know what you call, oh, it's got a little, it's got like a little crack in there. Look at it. $20, not my style. Not my style. It's fun though. All right. We got monitors upon monitors. That lamp, that lamp was special. You got the right spot for it. You got the right spot for it. All right. Check out some sporting goods. Hopefully we can find ourselves some more stuff to make this trip profitable. But if not, had a good time. That's all I'm out here for, so. Ooh, Dodgers hat. Like it's all banged up though. All right. I know we're not here for the hats. Let's see what we got in the random section. Window Wonderland. Some of these things sell pretty decently. I don't know about the Window Wonderland. I never look at it. It's 15 bucks. But those Christmas light projector thingies, I'll pick them up on the cheap. Right, let's see. What's down here? Some crutches. This is door handles. 
Nothing too hot or impressive back here. Now this actually pile is stockpiled almost like it was that day. Ooh. $15, youch. All right, let's see what else we might have. $15 is the new chibi. Oh, this is $30 right here. And this is not even in the right section it should be. The Satik X52 flight control system. I just saw one of these recently and it didn't go for it. It wasn't all that good. All right. La la. Thank you so much. The Canon printer listed used is 1200 bucks. That's the kind of stuff I like. You guys ever heard of Osborne the Thrift? He he picks up that kind of stuff. He's confident in his abilities and sold some amazing, huge, big ticket items. It's on YouTube and Instagram. Definitely worth a follow, friends. Out of Utah. And he gets big items like that. Big bucks. Big bucks. Could be $1,000 worth of profit there. Not after fees, and you only got to put out $200. Diana McMahon, hello, hello. Welcome. Happy Friday. Happy Friday. All right, more tools. Tools do not excite me. So they can bring great profits. Try not to pick up any tools anymore. How much is this bad boy? $25. $25. They're on top of everything now. They're on top of everything. Like this thing's uh, this thing's big, new. Let's hit them for 25. Atrocious. All right. Let's see what else we might have in here. Multiple times I found electronics that sell for hundreds of dollars at Goodwill. Oh, what is this thing? It's like a hair thing. Carmen, Carmen, friends. That's that's usually a good sign. This is some fancy rich man speaker. That's what this is. Forty dollars too. They're on top of it. They're on top of it. World Squirrel, Kristen, how you doing? Happy Friday. Look at this thing. It's almost like an oven, right? It's like a new wave speaker. Nothing might even be worth it too. Forty bucks. What is? What in the world does this connect into? What is that? If I hurt you, don't tackle huge items for resale. That is true. Wish I could just be a t-shirt man. All right. Sound sticks three is what this is. I don't know. Interesting. I dig it. I dig it. Gets the thumbs up from Mikey. Oh, Lala says that's big bucks. I have it. Oh, awesome. All right, Brenda, thank you for welcoming us. Thank you for welcoming. Judith, I forgot to. The spiders were requested. The spiders were requested. I forgot to list them and then I just forgot to sell them. So I guess I'm going to sell them next week in the jewelry. So I better let people know the spiders are going next week in the jewelry. Because, yeah, they were requested in the chat. I just totally bing, forgot. But the spiders are going to sell them whatnot. I'll start them at $3. And if I get $3, I think that'll be three more dollars than Supercourt thought I would get. But I have good faith in these things. They're fine specimens. Fine, fine specimens, these spiders and scorpions are. They preserved them very well and disturbingly well, if you, if you, ask, if you ask the people that were unpacking it. All right, bunch of bust on those. What else what we have? That Harmon Carmen speaker was pretty dope. I like the clearness of it. You don't see that. You don't see that. All right. I'm gonna go back into some more hard goods. We're floating around, left, right, side to side. Speedstream, Sony, Pioneer, Hewlett Packard. Some good names here. All right, let's turn it back in. Right on over here. 
the mug section. All right, I swore I gave up on, I had to pass on two coffee mugs today, friends. I, I was, I was tempted, I was tempted. One was a vintage Taz coffee cup, but I'm trying to have discipline, but not the coffee cups. I already have so much glass that's piled up. What'd you do with the tiny toy gun, Diane? Um, I don't, I don't know. I don't know where the tiny toy gun is, to be honest. I put it, I put it in my pocket and then I never saw what happened to it after or felt. It was a lot, it was a lot. Jackie Burns, how you doing Jackie? Thank you for hanging out with us. There was so much stuff and in the unit. All right, I gotta come back up here. Um, Supercore watched the storage unit video. She didn't go along to go unbox everything. And then she would be like, the deviled egg uh, container, where's that? I'd be like, that's not here. The step stool, where's that? Um, I can't find it. Um, what else did she ask? A few things, where's that, where's that? And man, friends, I gotta remember to bring this stuff home. If I put it on camera, I gotta make sure I know where it's at. Cause Supercore was looking for some stuff that just, uh, I don't know. I don't know, but I did get, I didn't show in the unit. We got a Costco step stool. It, like it's just a one stepper. You know, those are really nice. And then I got one that's like a three stepper that I can actually get really high. I've used it a lot. I have a six foot ladder that I use a lot, but this like, it's one of those Costco ones. It's really nice. And yeah, a two, two things we're using all the time around the house now. So it's amazing just the stuff you can use for yourself out of these units. So two really nice step ladders. Supercore did not claim too much of the jewelry. She did get a piece or two, but most of it's most of it's going to be sold on whatnot too. So hopefully, hopefully that goes well for me. And I'm already weighing the profits on the unit, so it's it's all gravy now. I had also uh, two pieces of furniture that I didn't show from the unit. I'll probably show it in my follow-up video, but like an armoire and a dresser that I sold. I didn't really want to bring them home. But I did, I did. Dan, the unit really did. It was my first unit ever, and I have gotta say, it was. I had some good stuff in there. I don't know if they're always like that. Of course, I hope they will be, and maybe even better. I didn't find a huge ticket item. I can't wait to find my first $1,000, $10,000, $100,000 item in a storage unit. I think I'm gonna keep up with it, though. It's, I mean, it's a lot of work, and, and luckily I'm feeling good enough to do the work right now. A few months ago, I definitely, I definitely couldn't have, uh, couldn't have done it. I haven't actually passed up an opportunity uh, with a big YouTuber I respect to go do some unboxing at a storage unit and even get all the stuff afterwards. But I just uh, I couldn't say yes. I couldn't say yes because I couldn't do any of the work. I couldn't commit to it. So if I commit to something, got to make sure I, I can do it. But I'm feeling better now, so I'm I'm all in. I'm all all in. All right. Let me see. Shot glasses. When I was 20, I thought shot glasses were cool. That's about it. All right. Oh, look at this, kangaroos. Friends, if you see a kangaroo by a lake, do you know what to do if you see a kangaroo by the lake? Let me know. Supercore just, just taught me. All right. All a girl wants to say, my new meds are working pretty well now. Um, they're working. I really need to do a full update, but my meds, they're helping me, but it's, I still got so many aches and pains. I've had some crazy, crazy days. So I'm actually even gonna start another medication on top of that. So hopefully, hopefully once, thank you, Jackie. Hopefully once I get on this other medication that I can, I can be more pain-free and have less symptoms, we'll see. I'm not looking forward to taking, injecting another medication. But I mean, that's, that's what they're saying to do. And I, I don't want to live in pain. I don't want to shoot medications either, but I definitely, some days the pain and the other things are just too much. But from the medication, I don't think I'm, I'm having too many bad side effects. That's for sure. Letty, how you doing? All right. Zika says watch too many videos that they get all trash. Yeah, I don't know. People pay to store the craziest things. That's for sure. Sometimes these crazy looking glasses can be worth something. 
Not like, like 3D glasses. Are these Epson 3D glasses? I mean like welding glasses. When I was here at grand opening day, someone got a welding helmet. I was so jelly of this welding helmet. I was like, it's got a whole welding helmet. I wonder how much that was for. I just found some welding stuff before and, and it did good. So that's, that's how you learn. I find one thing and then I'm just going for another. Yeah, the meds are definitely, definitely helping. So hopefully, hopefully my next, uh, the next dosage will help me out. I really hope so, but I, I'm doing way better with it than without it. So learning too more on my diet because I did, I, I was eating a little worse a little while ago and I, I was feeling the effects from it, I think. All right, deviled egg plate, all right. Yeah, super cool is like that deviled egg plate. We got so many deviled egg plates, but she wanted more. She wanted more. I don't know. It's very nice. I need to make some deviled eggs, I think is what we got to do. Definitely make some deviled eggs. Also, uh, some people told me in my latest storage video that there was some Tupperware. Uh, the Tupperware is gone. I don't have the Tupperware. Oh, Pioneer Woman dish. Like a wannabe Pyrex right there for $1.99. Yeah, that would almost be a good doggy dish. I'm tempted to have Clooney. Wouldn't mind a Pioneer Woman dish right there. All right. Let's see what else we got. Supercourt was still working. Judah says no methotrexate, please. It's the only thing helping. So Supercourt is still working when I left. So she's at home chilling. We got some plans this weekend, which includes some more house projects. We've been we've been killing it on the house projects lately, so we're going to uh, hang some more stuff, do some more art. We're going to change some stuff around. Got a TV to hang. I got to move it. This is Pyrex. Just picked up like a rainbow something set of this right here. All right, Letty found a Waterford for four ninety nine savers. Congrats, congrats. Yeah, so projects hanging, moving things, getting some more, trying to get more outdoor activities. The weather's getting better here. I know it's way better than where a lot of people are at, but the weather is getting better here. Kind of, uh, we haven't rode our bikes probably since December. It's been probably our longest streak in quite some time. We got to get back on it. Ninja Foodie, I know those can do well. Oh, that thing all looking, what tape, man? It's makes it look gross makes it look gross I used to always look for some juicers I had a juicer score when I first started all right Jody good evening good evening thank you for joining us thank you for checking out the storage video I had a lot of fun in storage video so I'm gonna definitely I want to do some more had some great reactions from people it just looks so fancy And it's been it's been profitable, so that's one thing that helps too. And you guys watch the videos too; it helps. Oh, hello, kitty. Frying pan. I heard of today for the first time. I heard about pancake pops. Friends like can cake pops, but pancakes. Have you ever heard of that? Have you ever heard of that? I wanted some want some pancake pops pretty bad now i didn't even know they existed till today now i want i'm gonna have to, have to, have to try to make some for myself all right Let's see what else we got the baggy selection hasn't been that great we haven't been filling up the cart yet today well no that is definitely not my specialty mikey buys less than any other reseller on youtuber no shame in my game no shame all right See what else we got. And I'm just talking smack on myself like I always do, unnecessarily. Just how we roll. Plastic tiki cups. It's a party. Oh, camelback. I love some camelbacks. That's got a little too nasty for me. 99 cents only, though. I should probably put my own lid on there. It's hard to pass up, but I'm going to. More discipline. Pass it up. All right. Just 
at all the plastic stuff here. I mean, lots of this other stuff sold, but this stuff is still probably all the stuff that since they opened is here. Look how deep it is. And it's still all color coded. Eight dollars. That's why this is still here. Eight dollars. We only need eleven more. Pancakes on a stick. Yes, pancakes on a stick. That's what I'm talking about. Keep your hands from getting sticky, because when you just eat them with your fingers, your your fingers get all sticky from the syrup. So, pancake on a stick. I want. I have to find out where you can find these things. They had like an as scene for TV. Is what they used to make them. All right, I'm gonna come down this interesting aisle of unknown now you never know what you're going to find in this aisle we got lynx a tract for her i don't know what that is spa life eucalyptus six dollars that's, that's that's stinging if you ask me that is stinging and a bag of that cheaper at Walmart. All right, Their mustaches, beards, animal manes, tall furs, etc. Sometimes these things can sell. No. Don't know. Oh, copyright 1990. Curly hair. All right, play practical jokes. All right, SB, thank you so much. Burdock root. All right. Appreciate everyone sharing so much good information. That's what's great about the internet and the community. We can share and learn from each other. Yeah, my my rheumatoid uh, journey has, has been quite the journey. Like I said I'm doing way better than I was, so that pleases me. But I think I got to work harder so I can feel better. That's the thing. I know diet's got a lot to do with it. I think for me, because when I eat bad things, sometimes I feel bad. One plus one equals two, right? Just got to uh, dial it in. Nine dollars for pedometer. All right, what else do we got? Office stuff, Bostitch, pencil sharpener, replacement toner. It's not a whole lot. It's not a whole lot. Sicket thinks the new Goodwill's overpriced. It's hard to, I am not finding the deals today. There were some good stuff on opening day, I gotta say, but today I'm not finding, not finding the deals. All right. Well, friends, we got a whole tour of the left side of the store gonna roll on out of here i am tired it's been a long day it's no excuse i appreciate you all for spending the time with me on a friday night choosing yeah that's pretty cool right there choosing to hang out and watch my videos i appreciate you all and next week uh next week super court's gonna do the whatnot with me the live show i was thinking of canceling the live show but i think i'm coming to come and do the live show that's what i do friday night mikey bags we hang out you guys all show up smack that thumbs up button so i'm gonna make sure i show up so yeah, check out the whatnot at four on Friday if you want. Streaming at six, and I'll have a new video Wednesday coming out. Probably might be what I did today. I had a lot of fun with Sunny and some new friends. Uh, yeah, I found some good stuff too. I found possible Murano, possible Murano. So tune in uh, Wednesday to check it out. I appreciate everybody, all of you. So many good names in there. Yeah, hope you have a good night. Peace.